हेलो एज वन सो इफ यू रिमेंबर लास्ट टाइम आई वॉज टॉकिंग अबाउट वन क्वेश्चन वन इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन ऑन द कम्युनिटी एंड दैट क्वेश्चन वॉज दिस वन लेट मी जस्ट ट्राई टू ओपन द क्वेश्चन डायरेक्टली सो दैट यू कैन ऑल्सो टेक अ लुक एट वट आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट सो बेसिकली देर वॉज अ क्वेश्चन ऑन द कम्युनिटी अबाउट ट्रेगरिंग एन ऑटोमेशन रूल यूजिंग मल्टीपल इवेंट्स now this particular uh, i mean I, i i of course talked about this and uh, the question was that can we have multiple events to trigger a rule and uh, the second thing was uh, can we have one rule trigger another rule now there is also this uh, thing this feature in automation rule when you create a new rule of course you can take a look at these events but there is also something called as multiple issue events which uh, uh, can of course work when you have multiple events related to the issue so this is something that i uh, didn't mention last time and uh, and if if you have uh, of course your issue related events only in your rule then this is i, I think a wonderful and uh, and i think this will uh, this will definitely be useful in case you want to uh, trigger your rule uh, based on issue creation issue assignee and so on so a short video but i thought i'll probably add and that is it that is all i wanted to talk about in this video i hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today thank you very much bye bye